Welcome to Top Wisdom, book by Elon Patton, Kai the Beloved Country, Chapter 1. There is a lovely road that runs from Ikobo into the hills. These hills are grass covered and rolling, and they are lovely beyond anything of it. The road climbs seven miles into them, the car is broke, and from there, it, if there is no mist, you look down on one of the fairest valleys of Africa. About you, there is grass and bracken, and you may hear the fallen crying from Diti Hoya, one of the beds of the veld. Below you is the valley of um, the Umzimkul. On its journey from tr the Drankensberg to the sea, and beyond and behind the river, great hill after great hill, and beyond and behind them, the mountains of the Ingeli and East Guikaland. The grass is rich and matted. You cannot see the soil. It holds the, the rain and the mist, and they seep into the ground, feeding the streams in every kloof. It is well tended and not too many cattle feed upon it, not too many fires burn it, laying bare the soil. Stand unshorn upon it, for the ground is holy, being even as it came from the Creator. Keep it, guard it, care for it, for it keeps men, guards men, cares for men. Destroy it, and man is destroyed. Where you stand, the grass is rich and matted. You cannot see the soil, but the rich green hills break down. They fall to the valley below and falling change their nature. For they grow red and bare, they cannot hold the rain and mist, and the streams are dry in the truths. Too many cattle feed upon the grass, and too many fires have burned it. Stand short upon it, for it is coarse and sharp, and the stones cut under the feet. It is not kept, or guarded, or cared for. It, it no longer keeps men, guards men, cares for men. The Ditihoya does not cry here anymore. The great hills stand desolated, desolate, and the earth has torn away like flesh. The lightning flashes over them, the clouds pour down upon them, the dead streams come to life, full of red blood of the earth. Down in the valleys, women scratch the soil that is left, and the maize hardly reaches the height of a man. They are valleys of old men and old women, of mothers and children. The men are away, the young men and the girls are away. The soil cannot keep them anymore. This is chapter one of the Kai Beloved of the Kai the Beloved Country by Ellen Patton. Please subscribe for the second chapter. Thank you.